Okay, folks, this will be an interesting one. You could call it an affirmation piece. Um, we'll soon find out what it is we're doing. It's a bit challenging. Uh, let's see how we go with it. I'm going to go dual colour. I'm going to start with black and red. going to leave it on 100. Going to lighten it a little bit. Going to add some contrast. All right, let's see what this affirmation piece is. It is a shirt with the word love. I'm just going to straighten up these sequins. But this is like two-tone sequins. Um, and this has just got the word L-O-V-E, love. It's just a word, but people like it. I don't understand why people just like words, however nice they are and however pretty they are. Uh, a word does have a place, but a word can't just be on its own. You can't just have a word like love uh, sitting on its own when all this when your life is full of hatred because this isn't going to do anything on its own it might be nice if you've got a loving life that you're living uh, if your life is full of love and this is just an extra reinforcement that's good but it's got to end in love true love I've been in relationships that were really bad and if you don't have love in, in, in your relationship, your relationship's null and void. And I've had plenty of null and void relationships and yeah, you just have to fucking... Now I'm going to move this, I think, down a bit that way. But basically, you got to find... Love has got to, you got to have a relationship that's healthy and happy. Otherwise, you're just going to have an empty word printed on a shirt or sequined on a shirt. And it's not good enough just to have a word and not have action. And action is where it starts. That's the kicker. You've got to have a fucking action. Instead of it being a, just a plain word. And that looks interesting. Uh, I think that's how we're going to have it. Um, but basically, love has got to be beyond an affirmation on a shirt or, or anything else. I wonder if we're going to, going to scrunch it or going to leave it like that. I wonder if scrunching it will make it look more interesting. Uh, I'm just going to scrunch it just a little bit in places just to give it a bit more interest. Um, I don't know how that's going to look. But basically, love is something that... It's something that most people don't understand. I know my father, who ha he's a hater. He doesn't understand love. And he married my mother and... He broke up with her, incidentally, as well. And I always felt lonely in my family, which to me indicates there's no love. And when there's no love in a relationship or, or a situation, you're going to feel a sense of loneliness, a sense of desolation. You're not going to feel warm and fuzzy. Now, that looks like we've just pushed those off the glass a little bit too far. But basically, you've got to somehow work out, you know. It's not easy. It's taken me decades myself to find out what love is. It's taken me decades. I've been, it's been less than a decade since I found out what love was. So I'm not exactly uh, experienced either as much as I should have been. Uh, now that looks interesting. I think we can use that. Um, 
wondering where the centre of the job is going to be. But yeah, love is a very important uh, human quality that we have to have and most people just don't make it. Most people miss the mark, like my father. My mum has learned, incidentally has learned how to love me, um, but my dad and my brother, they're still haters. And they hate me, I know they do. And I'm trying to prove them wrong as well, because I'm trying to get this artwork to go to air on television. Uh, I want my brother and my father to see that what I'm doing is not trifle. Now we're just gonna keep it on one going to change it to uh, black and green and we're going we're just going with the cold colors now I'm going to make mirrors but yeah love is an important ingredient that is missing in most people's lives which is really sad but it's true And most people will take it to the grave, which is really tragic, extremely tragic to take the hatred of life, life's hatred, to the grave. I'm actually thinking that looks like the centre of the job. We're just going to assemble it. So yeah, most people will take, take their, sorry, will take their hatred to the grave. So it's very important that somehow we find out what love is and make the world a better place. Because most people, there is a form of love that should never manifest in a human and it is called the love of money. That's the love that you've got to hate. The love of money is something you've got to hate because money has a place in society but we don't love it. And treat it like it's a, a master but all the other but love as, we, as in loving and caring for each other that's what we need anyway that looks really quite interesting uh, I do think we might make a switcheroo for this lovey dovey piece but this has turned out easier than I thought I thought this was really going to be a tough one uh, tough love, you hear about that too. Um, sometimes that's necessary. Uh, I don't understand much about it, um, but it, it does have a place in uh, certain situations. Anyway, let's see how we go with this. They always sing about it in the in the pop as well, in music. So it's a really important thing in your life. Anyway, I think that looks better. I think now I can call this demo quits.